LT Rob here. This is my midlife crisis. When I first went on testosterone replacement therapy, there was a lot of things I was scared about. I wasn't sure what to expect. Some things have gone better than I expected. Some things have not gone that well. Some things I had no idea were going to happen at all. Over the last couple of years, there's one thing that I figured out, and that's how to feed my body and maintain certain weight. And I've pretty much been in command of that situation. After years of obesity, it's shocking how much of a tight control I've gotten over my scale weight. Since I've gone on testosterone replacement therapy, I've experienced unexpected weight fluctuation and uh, unusual feelings that uh, I wasn't quite expecting. I was worried about ball shrinkage, to be honest with you, hair loss. Uh, bitch tits and a bunch of other things that I didn't think would be too cool to go through as a man and uh, to be honest with you at this point in my in my life I have passed a kidney stone which is supposedly the dude version of childbirth and in the uh, worst stages of my uh, testosterone deficiency when uh, my let's say manly functions were at their most compromised, it got to the point where we were on what I described as an accounting schedule or an IRS schedule, and we did it quarterly. So I can now say that I know what it's like to have sex out of a sense of obligation and guilt, to experience the pains of childbirth, and to go through menopause. I've become far more familiar with the plight of a middle-aged woman than I ever really wanted to. In fact, somewhere along the line, I've kind of lost track of what it means to be a man. And so what I did is I went to my wife and what has become, through the last couple of years, my best friend and try to lay it out, put my heart on the line and reach out for help. Things didn't really go as I hoped they would. I don't know. I just don't feel right. I feel bloated, flabby. And depressed and my pants don't fit right I don't know what to do seriously seriously it's fucking salad don't judge me. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm out of here. Hopefully as time goes by and my body adjusts to the influx of artificial hormones, I'll get a handle on things. But for the time being, it appears I'm down to one last friend. So far, he hasn't let me down. <laughs>